Hello one and all. So today we are having a very brief discussion on another very important pest of rice that is rice leaf folder Nephalocrosis medinalis Lepidoptera pyroliri. Now this uh, rice leaf folder it is distributed in the countries like Korea, Indonesia, Malaysia, Philippines, Pakistan and India. The moths of this Nephalocrosis medinalis, they are golden or yellowish brown and uh, the moth measures about 8 to 10 millimeter in length and 16 to 20 millimeter in wing expanse. The wings of those have 2 to 3 wavy lines characterized by dark bands and their greenish caterpillars are very agile and they feed inside the fold made by fastening together the edges of the lips. The moths of this rice leaf folder, they lay oval creamy white eggs which you were seeing over here singly or in pairs on the underside of the lips and lip seeds. The larvae from those eggs, they hatch within three to four days and the pale yellowish brown larvae become full grown in about 15 to 25 days. The pupation of those take place in loose silken webs in between leaves or in the leaf seeds. Now the young larvae they feed on the tender leaves without folding them and the older larvae they fashion the longitudinal margin of the margins of the leaf together with a sticky substance and feed inside the fold by scrapping the green matter. Now this is a typical symptom of rice leaf folder which you are seeing over here. You see that the scrapped leaves have become membranous and whitish and let's see whether the larva is there inside this folded leaf. So let's split the folded leaf and now yeah green is caterpillar is there. So this is the caterpillar of that Nephalocrosis medinalis. So these leaf folders they not only feed on the rice plants but also they feed on the grassy weeds which are available in the rice barns. Therefore removing the grassy weeds from barns can suppress, can decrease the population of rice leaf folder. Now considering various natural enemies like this one is an oxyopid spider. It is also a voracious predator of this leaf folder. This ladybird beetles, they also feed on the rice leaf folder. So all these natural enemies which are abundant in rice ecosystem or rice field, 
if the attempts are made to concept those then the leaf holder could be naturally suppressed and uh, other than those uh, judicious application of judicious use of fertilizers and uh, using the light traps at the rate of one trap per hectare can also catch the adults and very importantly releasing the egg parasitoid which is trichogramma chylonis at the rate of one lakh per hectare starting from 30 days after transplanting at weekly intervals can very well suppress this paste and as far as the synthetic pesticides or insecticides are concerned one can use cut of hydrochloride 50% SP at the rate of 2 gram per liter of water or profenophos 50 EC at the rate of 1.5 ml per liter of water or one can use as a directing 10,000 ppm at the rate of 2 ml per liter of water for successful management of this pest. Thank you very much.